He says good girl because the whole time I just assumed he was a girl. <laughs> but he's a boy. Huh? My name is Morgan and this is Stella's story for GeoBeats. Excuse me, can I can I have this back? Thank you. Stella is my yellow and Jane Ringneck parakeet. Thank you, thank you, thank you, lemon. Stella, Bella. He came into my life the summer of 2015. I actually rescued him. Ooh. This breeder was keeping parrots in fish tanks, a lot of them in not great conditions. And a month after I got Stella, that person got shut down. So luckily they are no longer raising birds. Now I advocate for rescuing parrots. Why are you getting all poofy? He wasn't comfortable around people for a long time. It took him about a year to even let me touch him. He absolutely loves my fiance. Stella, are you being a good sous chef? Stella, ready for takeoff? Three, two, one. The second that Stella met Tyler, he just fell in love and he likes Tyler more than me, basically is what I'm saying. You can't sleep in there. You gotta come out, Jeff. Jeff is my little buddy. <laughs> I have a hard boiled egg, and I think Jeff is scared of it. Jeff. What are you doing? When I got Stella, I had no idea if he was male or female, and I liked the name Stella. I thought it was really pretty. Are you being naughty? Male ringnecks don't get the ring that's around his neck until they're a year or two old. So I named him Stella, and then he got a ring. And I was like, oh no, you're a boy. A lot of people were like, you should change his name. But he's a bird, and he responds to Stella, so it do I don't think it's necessary, right? You like your name. Yeah. Does the good girl want a shower? Stella is very sassy. Why are you pecking the mouthwash? Huh? Parrots mimic words. This current word list is Morgan, good girl, pickle, peekaboo, what you doing, huh? He also says ouch after he bites people. He says, who are you? Do new people that come in. He also does the iPhone timer. He's just so good at mimicking it that I think it's my phone. Were you just eating Jeff's food? That's not yours. It's all over your beak. Do you have anything to say for yourself? Huh? You want to say sorry to your brother? No. It's pancake day. They're so intelligent. Jeff will literally go up to my thumb and just put his face against it a couple times to tell me that he wants to cuddle. He's the calm and collected one. Jeff figured out that if he taps the center of my headphones, it pauses the music. And now he won't stop doing it. Do you want it? Stella is the very loud in your face one. Basically, what Stella wants, Stella gets. He kind of runs the house. He's free roaming. Stella, you okay? If he wants to come into a room with you, he'll come right next to you and just talk no matter what you're doing. Yeah. I work from home most days, and all of my coworkers know who Stella is because he's constantly talking during our meetings. After years of training him, he loves people. He loves when my friends come over. He'll crawl on their heads and want scratches. Sometimes he gets really quiet, and then I know he's up to no good. Excuse you. Oh no, not the mirror. Stella, that's my water. Stella destroyed them. We've bird proofed this place. You're so strong. We used to keep our pots and pans out and then the birds would try and play with them and throw them on the ground, which then makes me afraid that they would get hurt. Stella, you don't even fit. Your tail's too big. All of our food has to be away because Stella will find it and he will eat it. Do you find the popcorn? You can't have that. Are you trying to get the cookies? I told you to not eat the dirt. Which one of your four working brain cells is telling you to eat dirt out of the plants? A lot of people keep chargers just kind of plugged into the wall. We can't do that. We have to make sure they go away so that the birds don't chew on them. Don't chew our things, Stella. <coughs> Stella is currently seven-ish. Expected lifespan is 30 years. How do you feel about global warming? 
I hope he lives out his whole lifespan. That would be amazing. Same with Jeff. Jeff, you need to work, buddy. I know you're comfortable, but you can't be there. I would love to have them for the next 25 years. That would be awesome. You got a foof on your head. Can I get it? <laughs> he stopped immediately. Uh -huh.